Hey everyone, how's it going? For today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw Godzilla Final Wars in a close-up version of the face. So hope you follow along and enjoy this video today. Now to start off with our Godzilla Final Wars face, let's begin with the eye. So we're going to start right about here and we're going to make a line that's just going to come back like this. Next, we're going to draw a line that's going to go down and then it's going to come up for the eyeball. For the pupil, we're going to go down and then we're going to come up here. And go ahead and color it in and I'm just going to leave a little bit white in the corner. Now for the eyebrow, I'm going to bring a line that's just going to come up and we're going to bring it back here and then over just a little bit. Now starting right here, I'm going to make a little line that's just going to go underneath the eye and then it's going to curve up. And then we'll make another little line right up here. Starting here, we're going to bring lines going to come up and down. And then another one is just going to come up and then down here. And then we'll do one more small one that's just going to go up and down. Starting here, um, for the nose, let's bring this line up and then we're going to bring it down. Then right here, we're going to go up and then curve it back for the nostril. I'm going to go ahead and color in most of this part of the nostril. And then down here we're just going to curve this around to kind of finish up the nose. Now starting out here I'm going to bring this line down and then we're going to curve it around for the front of the mouth. And we'll do the same thing here for the mouth. We'll just go down and we're going to bring it over connect that there. Then we're going to bring this up here. I'm going to leave a little break in there just to add some detail. Now starting here I'm going to bring this line down. We're going to curve it around and I'm going to bring it down to here. Next, we're going to go down, and then we're going to bring this up for the lips. We're going to leave a little space, and we'll just kind of curve this line around here. Right here, we're going to go down and up, and then down and up for the chin. We'll do one more little bump, and then we're going to bring it up high. Then we're going to bring it out here. And then I want to add a few little points out here just to add some texture right along the jaw. Now let's go ahead and finish off the mouth before we do any other details. Let's begin with some teeth. To start with the front teeth, we're going to draw a line that's going to go down and then up. And you can see it's a little bit at an angle. Then I want to put a few smaller teeth in front that just go down and up. Right about here, we'll go down a little bit farther and then bring this up for another one of those big fangs. Then we're going to add just a few more kind of small teeth back here and they can get a little bit bigger as they get back towards the back of the mouth. On the bottom, we'll do the same thing. They aren't going to be the big fangs, but we'll add some of these small teeth in here and they'll get a little bit bigger as they come back. Now starting here, I'm going to bring lines going to come up and then down. Another one's going to come up. We're going to go down here and we'll bring it back for the tongue. We'll add some little lines right in between here and bring it right down to there.
Now for the other side of the mouth, let's bring this line down and we're just gonna curve it down to here. Now starting right here for the top of the head, we're gonna make some long kind of broken lines. They're just gonna go back and they're gonna come down to here. And then we wanna add some little curved spikes across the back. So we're gonna make some lines that go up and down for these spikes. So we're just gonna curve some back here and we're gonna make them get a little bit bigger as they get along the back of the head. So we're just gonna make these bigger and bigger as they come across here. And then they're just gonna start, start to kind of curve down. We'll go right to about there. Now starting here, we're gonna make another eyebrow. So we're gonna draw a line that's gonna come up and then down to here. Now let's make the ear on our Final Wars Godzilla face. To start off, we're gonna curve a line that's gonna come up and we're gonna bring it out to a point. Then we're gonna make it come down and then curve up. We'll draw another line that just kind of follows that same shape of the top. And we'll do another curve line right across here. Now I'm gonna make some long broken lines coming down here for the neck. Then we're gonna make some long lines coming down here. Now, let's go ahead and add some more details. Let's start along the back. I'm gonna add some more spikes coming across the back here. And then right across here, I'm gonna make another little line that comes down. And then over here, I'm gonna make another broken line that just goes up and down just to add some detail. Now starting here, I'm gonna bring this line up and then I'll bring another line up here to show some detail on the neck. And then right across here, I'm gonna make some long kind of broken lines. They're just gonna come right across the front of the mouth. And then we're gonna add a few little spikes right across here, just for some detail and texture on the face. We're gonna make some more all along here. And we're just gonna kinda of add some more of these spikes. We'll make them a little bit bigger. And these spikes will add some nice check texture right across the face. We'll add some smaller ones up here as well. And it's almost like you're making little shark fins, just for a lot of detail. So we're just gonna kind of fill these up in here. Now I'm just gonna add a few more coming down here and a few more back here. Now I'm gonna add some of these big kind of curved lines right on along here. And I'm gonna do a few more coming across here as well. Next, I'm gonna add just some long broken lines right across here for some detail. And a couple more little broken lines right along here. I'm gonna add some lines on the top of the eye and even some right across the ear. I'm even gonna put a few little broken lines along some of these big spikes back here and maybe a couple more lines coming down. And I'm even gonna curve some of these spikes on here just to give it a little bit more texture and detail. You can kind of fill in some of these areas with a little bit more on some lines and everything. And there you go, there is your drawing of a Final Wars Godzilla face. I'm going to fast forward and start coloring this. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed.